when we look at the top 100 coins by market cap, Gala Games is the token that has the most upside. This is an all-encompassing blockchain ecosystem that's built for sheer entertainment. They've already solidified themselves as the play-to-earn ecosystem, but then we have Gala Music, which I believe will transform the entire music industry as we know it today. It's only a matter of time before Gala branches off into other spaces, like something like movie streaming. Believe it or not, even at a $2.5 billion market cap, Gala Games has a lot of room to grow. And if you stick around to the end, you'll find out about one of the greatest opportunities in crypto this year. If you love making money in crypto as much as I do and getting in early before everyone else, smash the like button and subscribe to this channel. I spend hours every day researching various cryptos, and Gala Games and soon-to-be Gala Music is easily one of the best investments in crypto this year. Gala started off with Gala Games, which has quickly become one of the most popular play-to-earn environments. And as of today, there's only a couple of playable games, Spider Tanks and Townstar. But that's about to change here pretty soon, as their roadmap shows that they have numerous upcoming releases, including Fortified, Last Expedition, Walking Dead, and easily one of the most anticipated games, Mirandus. And then we have Galaverse, which is scheduled for June of this year in Copenhagen, Denmark. If this year's event is half as good as last year's, then we're in for a real treat. The 2021 Galaverse was in Las Vegas last December and featured some huge announcements of upcoming games, demos, top-tier performances, and three days of just amazing entertainment. Gala's marketing, which includes Galaverse, is what's propelled them into becoming one of the largest and most loyal crypto communities. This will be a three-day event. The event itself will be, will be exclusive, be limited to only 800 tickets being sold. Cost of each ticket will come, around, come in at $8,000 for a single ticket, and couples can purchase a ticket for $14,800 that will give you a shared room. The price of the ticket does include the hotel. It is limited to two tickets for each purchase, and there will be no companion tickets. Now keep in mind that air travel will not be included. This is only gonna be for the three-day event and for um, the hotel. This year's, this year's event in Copenhagen on June 6th, 7th, and 8th is going to be epic. Expect a lot of announcements and buzz leading up to the event. Gala Music is looking to change the, the music industry forever. I would not doubt if we see a Gala, Gala record label here in the near future. One of the biggest problems that music artists have is not owning their own music. And then you have third-party companies like Apple and Spotify who see upwards of 90% of the profit, leaving artists with a fraction of money that they've actually earned. Gala isn't the first company to try and bring music to blockchain, but all others who have tried before them have failed. Gala has what no other company in the entertainment industry on blockchain has, and that's a community. This is one of the strongest communities in all blockchain. The team just recently announced Gala Music, and there's still a lot of unknowns. Remember, this is an entirely new space, and we're talking about what's allowing artists and fans to take full advantage of blockchain technology. We're talking about giving control back to the artist, allowing them to determine how they mint, drop, and distribute music by means of NFTs, however they want. This is also the perfect environment for recognizing and finding new talent. But let's face it, it, I think it's safe to assume that the majority of the best musicians in the world are the ones that we'll never ever hear about because they're never given a chance. This is why platforms like America's Got Talent, American Idol have become so popular because they give regular people like you and I the opportunity of a lifetime. Gala Music is that same type of platform, but much better. There's already numerous partnerships with some of the most influential musicians out there. We're talking Snoop Dogg, Maroon 5, Kings of Leon, and Steve Aoki. This is going to be huge. And just like how blockchain is revolutionizing the video game industry, expect the same with music. And Gala Music will clearly disrupt the multi-trillion dollar industry. This is getting it on the ground floor before most others even know that blockchain music even exists. Now, this isn't something that may or may not happen because it's already happening. Snoop Dogg is releasing his next album, BODR, as a blockchain NFT exclusive. The first promotion is already live, which is Snoop Dogg's Snashbox NFT. This is limited to just 25,000 copies. Each box will include one of 17 song NFTs from his BODR album. This leads us into Gala nodes. Now, nodes are required to power the entire network that are run by node operators. This is anyone who purchases a node, people like you and I. Because the Gala Games Network is a blockchain-based gaming platform, 
The network needs some sort of decentralized network of computing power to make sure these games operate, and the network is secure, stable, and cheap to run. People who purchase nodes take on a small part of the work, which is essentially providing computing power that's necessary for games to run on the ecosystem. As a reward, node operators are rewarded with gala tokens and NFTs, which is a great source of passive income. I never owned or operated a node, but from what I hear, the ROI is almost too good to pass up. Gala nodes have become quite lucrative, and they've and they incrementally go up in prices when they're the more they're sold. <coughs> When the nodes were first introduced, you could pick one up for about $2,000, but now it'll cost you about a hundred grand for one Gala node. Gala music nodes were just introduced. And as of today, they're only about $1,200 each. These nodes will specifically power the Gala music ecosystem. Now, unlike Gala nodes, which are capped at 50,000 total licenses, it's still unknown how many Gala music nodes will become available. Since this is a totally new industry, the team stated there eventually will be a cap, but it's impossible to determine what the cap should be now until they have an idea on how big the industry is actually going to be, which does make sense. You can expect that the price will go up over time, so if you're interested or you're thinking about picking one up, you might want to get in early so you get the greatest return on your investment. $1,200 per, per node is not bad. Running nodes is a great passive passive income opportunity. When Gala Music kicks off, they're going to release a Gala, Gala Music token, which will power the entire economy. Similar to the Gala token on how it powers Gala games, the Music token will be specific to the music economy. The team hasn't released all the lot on the details of the new token, but they have released payouts for node operators. For each song that's played, the system will mint 10 cents worth of, worth of the Gala Music token, this newly minted token is then distributed with 45% split evenly to everyone who owns the song. 10% will go to all nodes on the music network, whether you own that song, song NFT or not. 5% to the specific node that plays the song, and the remaining 50% goes to the artist. If you're thinking about buying more than one NFT of the same song to make a little bit more extra money, don't worry about it. Each node can only hold one instance of each track, so buying multiples of the same song has no benefit at all. To purchase a Gala Music node, it seems to be super simple. I haven't purchased one yet. I've still got a lot of research to find out exactly what it entails on running a node. I've never done anything like this before. So to start, you'll have to first create an account if you don't already have an account. Now the Gala accounts are, are, are universal throughout the ecosystem. So if, you have a, if you've already created an account with Gala Games, you won't have to create a, a, another account for Gala Music. Simply just log in with your same credentials. If you don't have an account for anything on the Gala ecosystem, you have to first register to create an account. Now I already have an account, but it's super simple. It's just name, email, display name, and password. Once you hit create account, you'll, they'll send you an email. You have to confirm it by confirming the uh, link of the email itself, and then come back and log in. Now once you log in, you just click buy now. Once you, actually, I'll go ahead and uh, log in here. Ah, oh, figures one time authentication. So the when I set this up, I used a, a third party app, um, which allows me to authenticate and just provides a little bit more security. Which if it doesn't prompt you to do that. I would recommend doing this when you do sign up for your account. It just gives you a little bit more peace of mind, especially if you do end up buying a note or, or putting some money into, um, you know, put Gala coins or put any kind of Ethereum into your account. You definitely gonna wanna just have that extra uh, added layer of security. So currently the price of a node is gonna cost you about 3,500 Gala tokens, which at the current price is gonna cost about $1,200 US. So to purchase a node, you have to first fund your Gala account with Gala tokens, which are going to be enough to be able to cover the actual purchase of the node itself. And you're also going to have to fund it with a little bit of Ethereum because it's going to cost a little bit of gas to be able to, uh, to, to create the transaction, confirm the transaction. So if you don't have any Gala tokens into your account, you, you want to send over Gala. And like I said, you want to send over some Ethereum to be able to cover the transaction. Now, I, I have not purchased a node, but what I did last night was I sent Ethereum from my Coinbase account 
to the gala account and it's super simple if you transferred any coins from one exchange to another how you have to utilize you know you have to copy the code either you do it through a qr code if you're doing it on mobile or you'll have to copy and then paste the code if you're doing it on desktop i'm working on desktop right now and that's how i did it last night all i did was copy a code that um that uh i received from gala music i went to place my order It'll tell you how much ETH you're gonna have to use for the transaction. You can actually, you can make it a little bit slower, a little bit faster, and you set that and see how the, the cost of the ETH actually changes. Cost of gal is not gonna change, so that's gonna be pretty static. So if I were to make this transaction go, I would have to transfer um, this amount of ETH, which is less than $10, and this amount of gala, which is about $1,200 from uh, and, and an exchange where I purchase it over to the Gala, uh, this Gala account. I used Coinbase, like, like I said, I used Coinbase last night to transfer ETH, and it was super simple. Um, to be able to do this, you also have to transfer over Gala. Like I said, I'm still on the fence only because I don't know what in, it, it totally entails. I'm running a node. To, I need to do a little bit more research on that to make sure that this is something I want to do. So I, I don't want to get stuck with a node and not be able to use it. And it just wouldn't make a whole lot of sense for me. Um, so if you're interested, go through these steps. Like I said, it's super simple um, to, be able to, to be able to transfer the money from you know an exchange over to Gala to make the purchase. My understanding is that the Gala music nodes are not yet live. Once you purchase the music node, um, you'll get an email. And then once the music node goes live or the the ecosystem of environment actually goes live, then you'll uh, be able to activate and, and, and install the software to be able to run your node. That's my understanding of it. Like I said, I, I'm not too familiar on, I'm not familiar at all on running nodes. So I'm not, I, I can't really provide you the details, but um, if you wanted to transfer um, Ethereum, like last night I transferred, $10 in Ethereum only because I wanted to see on how the process worked. I wanted to see how fast it was. So if you want to do the same, um, you just log in here, provide get Ethereum. Like I said, I use Coinbase. Um, so I went to my Coinbase account. I moved money or moved Ethereum from my Coinbase Pro account over to my Coinbase account. I copied this code here. I pasted it on the uh, transfer from, from Coinbase. And then I hit send and then it probably wasn't even no more than 10 minutes. It's probably closer to five minutes where the Ethereum showed up in my um, Gala account. I'm assuming this it's going to be the exact same process for transferring Gala tokens from an exchange over your Gala account. You're just going to hit get Gala. Um, if you're on mobile, you use the QR code. Like I said, I'm on a desktop. So I, all I did was just copy this code, paste it over in Coinbase, and then I hit transfer or hit send and then it comes uh, over my account and it, it took me like i said not not even 10 minutes so probably closer to five minutes and then the uh, ethereum was in my account and then once you have the ethereum to be able to cover the transaction cost the gas fees and the amount of gala you're going to need to be able to purchase the node just go ahead and purchase the node um and then i think it's that's really a, it's pretty self-explanatory um, i watched a couple of videos on it and it seemed like it was just super easy and and that's really that. So like I said, when we look at Gala Games on CoinGecko, it comes in at right at about a $2.5 billion market cap. Now it's down significantly, just like the rest of the market over the last couple of months. Gala Games was upwards of better than a $4 billion market cap. So it's clearly got a lot of room to go just to get back to its all-time high. But this token here can easily hit a $10 billion market cap. And I think it's going to get closer to, to 20, if not higher, by the end of this year. We're talking about there's some huge releases coming out, you know, and and not including Gala Music, which you know a lot, a lot of that popularity and a lot of that a lot of that fuel will move over into the the Gala token itself, even if the Gala Music comes out with its own token. So it's been one of the biggest movers in the last couple of days. It's up 16% on the day in the past 24 hours. When we zoom out and look at the the all time. It was listed back in, I think it was September. It started out as, you know, under a penny. It, it 
in November, it went from, it did a 10X in just November in a matter of two weeks. It went from eight cents upwards to 71 cents. And then the market crash. And then this is where the market came down to. And it came down to 18 cents. It's recently come back up to about like 37 cents, I think it was. And then it recorrected, which was the latter part of last week. And then today it currently sits at about 34 cents. So Gala Music is, I mean, the Gala token has tremendous upside. Um, it, it really is. It's fueled by an entire ecosystem of blockchain gaming. But this ecosystem itself is so expansive beyond gaming. Like I said, they're incorporating music. They have one of the largest crypto or crypto communities out there, extremely loyal. And the marketing team that's that's with this token here, they do a tremendous job. I mean, if you ever follow their Twitter feed, I mean, they, they engage with their community. They're extremely active um, and they provide a lot of value from from within their their social media feeds. Uh, if you're interested in Gala Music, I would recommend joining their Discord get a lot of information out there especially since this is a, a a newer obviously a newer niche newer project um you'll find out a little bit more about some of the artists that they've already onboarded like i said like snoop maroon five and a few of the others but i would uh, recommend joining their discord you'll find the link at the bottom of their page on the gala music page i believe it is um, if you scroll down to the very bottom of the page and you can click the Discord, like I said, follow them on Twitter, Instagram, read their Medium articles, really, really good articles to tell you everything that you really need to know. Um, hopefully I was able to explain this in, in pretty good detail, at least make you aware of it to, to give you something to put on your radar so you can do your own research. Um, Cause like I said, Gala Music, Gala, Gala Games, and just the entire Gala brand itself is blowing up. I mean, there, there's no denying that. And this is going to be one of the best, best investments easily in 2022. So hopefully I, I, I did a pretty good job with this video. Um, like I said, I'm relatively new in, in crypto or relatively new in YouTube. So I've been on for about six weeks now. I think I've already gotten uh, about 14, 1500 subscribers. So I try to post regularly. Um, obviously, some days a little bit better than others, but. Let me know in your comments what you think about Gala Games, Gala Music. Um, let me know if you're invested. Let me know if you believe that this could hit a $20 billion market by, by this year or next. I, I definitely do. I definitely do. I think this is going to be one of the biggest movers in all of crypto and especially the top 100 coins. So if you're looking for a safe investment, if you're looking for an investment that you're going to get a really good return on your investment, of course, this is not financial advice. This is only my own opinion. But I think Gala Games and the higher Gala ecosystem is going to easily be, like I said, a thousand times, is going to easily be one of the best investments in crypto in 2022. So I'm Scotty B. Crypto. Uh, let me know in the comments what you think. Please like the video if you like it, subscribe to the channel, and stay tuned for more. That's all I got.